Good evening, everybody. Tracy Cornett here in the WSMB4 News Now Studios. Want to get you up to speed on what we're working on here for 10 o'clock tonight. And the big story that we covered here, our Brenton Tierney reporting this for us here in Nashville. A man was arrested after police say he broke into his neighbor's home in the middle of the night, claiming he was held at gunpoint and needed to steal items. A terrifying evening. WSMV's Brendan Tierney talked with people in the area who are concerned that their homes may be targeted next. Metro police say a man was woken up early yesterday morning by the sound of this glass door shattering. He ran downstairs, restrained the thief, and pulled off his ski mask just to realize it was his next door neighbor. It could be your own family, you never know. <laughs> Erica Lopez lives down the block and says she wasn't surprised because there's been a string of car break-ins in the area. You're like on your 10 toes and nervous all the time. But she never expected one of her neighbors to break into a home here. That's even more terrifying, you know, because there's people in your home and you don't know what you could wake up to or what could happen. Police say this video shows the man walking through the fence and messing with a security camera before breaking the back door. He told officers he was held at gunpoint and forced to rob the home, but police believe the man just thought no one would be there because of an ongoing holiday. It's crazy and it's sad and it's terrible that's happening, you know, even your own neighbors. Erica says she's going to install security cameras of her own after this robbery and warn people to be extra careful of their neighbors. Make sure my doors are locked, my windows are locked. Um, but I mean, I mean, there's not much I can really do, to be honest. I talked with the thieves family today. They didn't want to go on camera, but said they were told the same story about him being robbed and haven't been able to figure out when or where it happened. In Antioch, Brendan Tierney, WSMV4. Certainly an unusual story there that we will continue to follow and see what happens next. And another story we're working on here for 10 o'clock started breaking earlier tonight. Williamson County uh, medical personnel, uh, all sorts of different first responders sent to the hospital after an unusual substance that nobody knows at this hour. Police investigating what this particular substance was that sent so many people to the hospital. We've got the very latest uh, situation, the numbers and what our Danielle uh, has figured out and learned from the scene, talking to witnesses and talking to emergency uh, uh, professionals there in Williamson County. Our Danielle Jackson working on that story in about 15 minutes here on WSMV4 at 10 o'clock. I'm Tracy Cornett. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you on TV.